Hello everyone, welcome back to Placement Buddies. Let me welcome you all to another episode of Let's Hear from the Experienced. And today, in order to share her interview experience with Dell Technologies, we have Medha with us. Hello, Medha. Welcome to Placement Buddies. Hey, mm-hmm. hi, Saleh. Thank you for having me here. So, Medha, अपने बारे में हमारे ऑडियंस को कुछ बताओ. So, uh, hey, hi guys. I, I am Medha Mansi, and I belong to Patna, Bihar, and I have graduated in uh, 2021. I did my B Tech. from uh, sikkim manipal institute of technology and it was in electronics and communication engineering after that uh, i have been working in dell and i just completed one year today today is the date when i completed one wow. year congratulations <laughs> congratulations yeah, on your work anniversary you. meda <laughs> yeah thank you yeah so how did you come to know about uh, this opportunity in dell technologies guys before we move ahead you might not know that many of you about 93% of you do not subscribe to the channel please subscribe to our channel turn on the notifications do press the bell icon i request you all now let's continue so basically it is back in 2019 so there was no sign of covid that time and it was the month of october i still remember clearly because it was my first hackathon or the first uh, uh, company experience i would say okay. so just we got a notification that dell is going to hire uh, for internship and that was the first time we were having it uh, for internship of summer interns like in the third year we were having it. so that was first time for my college and uske baad like um, we just uh, came to know we had a form to fill if you are interested uh, you can fill and uh, then they had done the uh, screening if you say and that was done from the company itself and uh, to be very frank it was career 70 career 70 means you need to have 70% in 10th 70% or greater in 12th and 7 cgpa overall so that was their uh, cut off so after that 80 people were selected and then we had that hack- hackathon all right so how is a hackathon different from other uh, like internship opportunities hackathon mein kya kya hota hai basically बेसिकली हैकेथॉन में क्या होता है ना जैसे कि नॉर्मल प्रोसीजर में अगर हम लोग जाते हैं तो क्या होता है कि एप्टीट्यूड होगा hmm. फिर आप नॉर्मल इंटरव्यू में जाओगे फिर आपका एचआर इंटरव्यू होगा एंड ऐसा होता था उस टाइम वो ऑफलाइन था तो ऐसा हुआ था कि वी गॉट अ नोटिफिकेशन और समथिंग लाइक दैट इन आर मेल एंड देन यू आर सपोज टू गैदर इन वन सेमिनार हॉल एक्चुअली सो वहां पे क्या हुआ था कि वी वर आई सेट दैट वी वर सेलेक्टेड राइट एट्टी पीपल वर देर सो देर वी वेंट एंड वी वर डिवाइडेड इन टू ग्रुप्स Right. by default like it was all uh, divided and the branches they selected was ec it and csc not for civil and mechanical and uh, then we went and then we were divided into groups of four people all right so uh, after that it was a random distribution of five numbers 1 to 5 so we were get, given like each group got a number and okay. that day and this is 10 days before the inter- uh, before the internship day be- before the hackathon day basically so what happened was ki we went to hum log us room mein gaye and then fir uh, there were uh, two or three faculties that was virtual ki okay. wo uh, dell ke log the and wo log aaye the wahan pe and they were explaining actually five uh, whatever the five problem statements we had ki isme kya karna hai aapko isme kya karna hai aapko pura problem statement aapko explain kiya gaya Deli- deliverable uh, deliverables bhi explain kiya gaya and agar aapko kuch bhi us time doubt hai mm-hmm. you can go and ask not a problem to aapko pura problem statement 10 din pehle bata diya gaya tha all right yeah so you guys were about to like provide a case study kind of solution or it was related to coding um see matlab main mere ko do to clearly yaad hai mera bhi yaad hai and one more ka ya pura yaad hai so mere mein kya tha like we had to make a basically a drag and drop feature using any of the uh, like basically ui banana tha hame okay and wo search search and advanced search and ye sab implement karna tha so any technology we could have used used aisa tha hamara and then ek ko ek ko mila tha chatbot se related and thode aur advanced features bhi the usme and it's up to you because you are in third year student right you don't know itna bhi right. you're not familiar with uh, those technologies so uske baad fir aapko jitna bhi matlab jit, jitna bhi aap kar sakte ho it was not a hard and fast rule if you're doing it all then it's well and good bahut sare usme conditions the and ek aur tha uh, it was like basically recommendations jaise aap dekhte ho na ki youtube dekhte ho to is type ke recommendations aate hain to aapko ek recommendation मॉडल बनाना था ये तीन तो मुझे याद है दो और भी थे समथिंग रिलेटेड टू दैट एंड इट इट वाज अ वेरी प्रैक्टिकल प्रोजेक्ट आई वुड से व्हिच यू हैड टू डू एंड यू हैड टू लर्न अ टेक्नोलॉजी फ्रॉम द स्क्रैच क्योंकि आप क्योंकि आपको कॉलेज में इतना नहीं अभी बताते हैं यू डोंट नो व्हाट डायलॉग डायलॉग फ्लो इज व्हाट 
angular itna nahi batate us time pe react and all of that so basically we had to learn all of that and implement it so yeah that is how it was so it was like uh, implementation of your learning kyunki wo us moment pe kisi ko known nahi rahega ki okay right. yahi question right. ya yahi problem statement aane wali hai so whatever right. concepts right. you have gathered in your college days or through other learning so usko right. wahan pe implement karna tha right डेफिनेटली अगर कोई फ्री लांसिंग कर रहा था उस टाइम पे लाइक बहुत सारे स्टूडेंट्स होते जो फ्री लांसिंग करते जो मोर इन टू कोडिंग उनके लिए काफी बेनिफिशियल था क्योंकि दे वर यूज टू दिस टाइप ऑफ प्रोजेक्ट तो उनके लिए एक बेनिफिट भी था सो अगर किसी को फ्री लांसिंग करना था लिटरली सजेस्ट क्योंकि दैट इज वॉट इंडस्ट्री रिक्वायर्स दैट हेल्प हमें बनाना कुछ नहीं था सिर्फ रिसर्च करना था ये ये हमारा टेंडेंस हुआ आपको जहां गूगल नेट जिससे पूछना है जो करना है आप कर लो क्योंकि आप एक टेक्नोलॉजी स्क्रैच से सीखने ही वाले हो अगर किसी को आता है तो वेल एंड गुड बट जनरली किसी को उतना ज्यादा नहीं आ रहा था एंड देन वी हैड टू डेज का हैकेथ फुल अगर okay. आपको बैठना है तो रात भर भी बैठ सकते हो वहां पे कॉलेज अलाउ कर रही थी okay. पूरा फोर्टी एट आवर्स एंड डेल के भी हमें एक एक लाइक पूरे के पूरे जैसे आई टोल्ड यू राइट वन टू फाइव एक नंबर था तो okay. हर एक नंबर पे एक हमारे डेल के भी लाइक सीनियर थे जो हेल्प करने के लिए थे लाइक एनी डाउट यू कैन आस्क एंड हमारे कॉलेज से भी एक मेंटर असाइन हुए थे सो वी हैड टू पीपल तो आप यू कैन रीच रीच आउट एंड तो आप लोग को जो भी बनाना था जो भी मॉडल कर रहे हो जो भी कोडिंग कर रहे हो जो भी फ्रंट एंड यूज कर रहे हो बैक एंड यूज कर रहे हो एनी थिंग यूर यूजिंग वहीं पर बैठ के करना था आप लोग को चारों को मिलकर and uh, they had provided this uh, github cake link and there you had to add and everything was someone who had told you everything but from scratch you had to do it in two days nothing nothing before that and after that you had to submit it as i told uh, a senior the hamare del se del ke the and he was our alumni from our college so he uh, told us ki yahan pe upload karna hai and wahan pe humne actually seekha tha git push git pull because us samay hame wo sabhi nahi aata because i was from to electronics we never used to do these things so that was also very helpful and like another tip ki git github ke git ke sare command seekh lo jitna frequent jitna acche se aayega utna acha hoga and uh, उसके बाद वट हैपन वॉज वी वर अबाउट लाइक दी सेकेंड डे राइट आफ्टर द फर्स्ट हाफ वी हैड टू प्रेजेंट इट वट एवर वी हैड डन ऑल दी ग्रुप्स एंड वहां से वहां से दे पिक्ड सम पीपल जरूरी नहीं था कि चारों के चारों को पिक किया गया था चार में से एक को पिक किया गया चार में से दो को पिक किया गया एंड समथिंग लाइक दैट ट्वेंटी टू ट्वेंटी फाइव पीपल शॉर्ट लिस्टेड फॉर इंटरव्यू राउंड Okay. And after that, it was a because the presentation was a technical round. There were five people from Dell and one HR. So they asked us technical questions regarding how we did it. And what they looked for was the approach you had put in, even if you had not completed the project. You have done so much work in technology. You have done so fast. You have learned and implemented it because that is how it requires in the real industry as well. Correct. Correct. It's not quick because uh, technology. So, yeah, today something is, tomorrow something is. If you can't switch it, then you can't do it. नहीं सीख पाओगे ना तो फिर दैट इज व्हाट दे वाज या योर प्रेजेंटेशन स्किल्स हाउ वेल यू कैन यूज योर टेक्नोलॉजी हाउ स्ट्रांग यू आर विद दैट एंड दैट इज व्हाट कन्वर्सेशन वी हैड एंड देन फिर वहां से 10 वेट 20 25 पीपल वर सिलेक्टेड एंड देन वी हैड गॉन फॉर द इंटरव्यू एंड आफ्टर दैट सम पीपल वर सिलेक्टेड लाइक 10 15 वर सिलेक्टेड फॉर इंटर्नशिप सो व्हाट वर द टेक्नोलॉजीज इन व्हिच यू हैड टू वर्क लाइक फॉर द हैकेथॉन अम फॉर फ्रंट एंड लाइक आई यूज्ड एंगुलर and uh, for uh, back end that time i used javascript okay so depending on the yeah team you could have used react also um, up to you like uh, when did you start uh, your preparation for this angular and uh, javascript and what was your roadmap yeah. yeah basically i told you right that 10 days ago we were informed mm-hmm. so I, i had no clue about it and that is the first day like 10 days i had given it right. from scratch because yeah to learn it how well you learn it that time obviously i was not that confident we were uh, just trying and trying all the features and everything yeah correct and what were the sources of your preparation yeah it was uh, like angular as angular.io website right so i went through all the documentation uh, and read it because that is the best way you need to read youtube's i know uh, there are some uh, there, there were some videos which we took for like drag and drop feature i told right so for that we can understand the functionality from some youtube channels mm-hmm. but you need to understand how angular works what is angular framework and it's a pretty huge uh, framework like i could have used react i would say i did not have much yeah. knowledge about because react was a pretty uh, easier at that time but uh, yeah i to angular so that was a pretty difficult task to do because it's still very huge <laughs> so you need to right. understand a lot of things. Yeah. yeah but i must mention you are a very quick learner otherwise you couldn't have cracked that hackathon within 10 days of preparation only right yeah. 
right right we had a good team i would say and yeah. we all did very good yeah and like h- how did you find it like did you find it difficult to make a like transition from a non cs background to you know uh, something related to something which is very much related to cs so what was it all about yes uh, definitely uh, yes i would say because uh, what happens is your basics right hmm. uh, you need it all the time Correct. so when somebody was like literally i'm uh, being very frank like api calls how they are doing how we are connecting it to the db because right now i'm working as a full stack developer so you need to know these things and i know a cs developer um, ke liye ye cake walk hai correct to mere liye tha to wo sab seekhne ke liye you know like uh, you have to put in a little extra hours and you do not have to give up because every day i feel like okay i'm not able to do, the, do this tab sound wala kar pa raha hai so just keep going if you are into it you'll be able to do it awesome and uh, what was uh, your interview experience like interview mein kis type ke questions puche gaye the and what yeah. were your strategies for uh, cracking the interview basically right so um for a technical round right uh, because we had to present whatever we had made hmm. so be true to that do not over brag if you did not do something or if you don't know because they'll ask you very uh, basic questions if you don't know don't say it but if you know it just tell them whatever it is and for uh, hr i would say um be who you are you do not have to brag a lot no Correct. you don't yeah be who you are if you because they'll ask you very basic questions you'll you'll be like okay is it it is that it they might ask you about your hobbies and you don't know how you're getting judged so just be who you are that's it nothing more nothing less correct so uh, the interview was you can say like mostly it was technical but there were hr questions also there are actually two rounds like i told you okay. right a first one first one was by when you are presenting right so mm-hmm. five people were sitting and they were asking you all the technical questions and then when you got shortlisted it was a one on one with the hr so that was in a closed room yeah and that that was in a presentation hall type of a thing the technical round was uh, an elimination round or it was like yes yes what happened was uh, in the technical round um we were group of four right so all the uh, four people uh, were presenting for that whole project whatever you had done mm-hmm. so okay. after that uh, from that 80 people only 23 went for the hr all right all right so yeah uh-huh. there was like a lot of deductions in uh, the technical correct. round right correct correct got it, yeah. got it. what was your preparation road map and you know what were your sources of preparation for being a software engineer and if any fresher have to start uh, right from the scratch like from second year or first year itself then what should be the path yeah so basically the road map which uh, i had followed was because i was very sure that i want to go in the it field and my background was non cs so uh, basics of oops c++ um i had started back in third year only because you need to know these things before you go jump into any technology i would not suggest that you uh, you learn angular or react or vue or mongo db or c well no nothing like that because it all depends on which team you are going which project you are getting so that you will be able to learn but keep your basics clear if you know that okay i want to be a back end developer so you should know what oops is if you are a front end developer you should have the eager to learn okay how the framework works what are the things i should use and everything like that and if, and if you are going for um full stack you should know all the things even the database part like mongo db right. sql queries so nothing to pressurize yourself but freelancing projects definitely help in the flow correct correct and now when you you have worked for dell technologies for almost one year right now like today you were right. updating your one year uh, yes. down the memory line what do you feel what was that like what was that moment when you have uh, you know decided that okay i have to crack this hackathon and uh, like i have to get into dell technologies what kept you motivated for that uh yeah to be very frank i told you right that was the first uh, company which came to our college okay and um, we were very excited to work like i was very excited to work in an it company um uh, because i wanted to because i really wanted to and dell technology is a very nice company a good oh, name okay. and everything yeah so i was like okay we need to i need to crack this and i need to learn whatever it takes i did whatever it took to be there correct correct uh so how is like dell as a it company and how is dell for freshers right now what do you think yeah it's like it's very nice i would say because uh, the hours working hours very flexible mm-hmm. like uh, the people talk about work life balance and everything it it gives you all 
and plus there are many stretch projects for example if you're working in a team which is working on say um, sql and uh, for uh, back end they're using dot net but maybe your interest is uh, to work in some other technology so you have a lot of stretch projects which keep coming as a fresher you get a lot of opportunities lot of ha hackathon so if you want to do something extra also right there are a lot of paths even for patents everything they support in any type of innovation so apart from work also you learn a lot and yeah. by uh, and in dell right there are a lot of seniors you get to know a lot everybody is approachable even the highest authority is approachable that's great so that that's is, awesome yeah. yeah so that is uh, how the culture is commendable i would say because i have uh, heard of, of other 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 friends also mm -hmm. not naming any company but yeah uh, nowhere it's so flexible i would say correct so you can uh, like anyone can easily switch between projects or technologies right I internal uh, job postings ijp we call it so okay. yeah that is also there and uh, after a certain amount of time right because obviously you not start and we like okay i need to go not like that but after a certain amount of time you can definitely apply you can keep your manager in loop everybody is there you can just ping them and they'll be there to help you motivate you and uh, help you to boost your career in all all the ways possible awesome awesome so medha before wrapping it up like if you want to give any tips to our juniors or the viewers who are watching this video right now do not stress so much life is a long 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 way to go just be calm and everything is going to happen in a very good way and time has all the answers i would say just keep working on your technology and whatever tech stack you want to just keep learning every day is a new day and always be up for unlearning and then learning not awesome. only learning awesome that's awesome. it awesome thank you so much medha for your time and uh, coming to placement buddies we wish you all the best for your future endeavors Thank you thank you Salai it was nice talking to you bye yeah.